decided to do a silly experiment and to see what kind of effects I would get on my yarn if I were to add the dyes to the dye bath first uh, and then add the yarn. Now clearly when you add different dyes into water they're going to blend together but I wasn't going to stir the dyes before I eventually put the yarn in and I was curious how much variation of color we might get from not stirring. I waited a little while and then removed yarn from both of the boxes and put it back in to blend the colors. And while on our container where we had yarn before the dye, we see a lot of blending of color. There are still more distinct patches of those original colors because some of the dye started to bind to the yarn in the 15 minutes that I waited. If I was doing this on non-superwash yarn, we probably would see even more blending of color because less pigment would have started to bind to the yarn before I lifted and moved everything. Ultimately, what really impressed me was how much variation there was still in the yarn where I added the dye first. To be fair, I did not stir it. And yes, things are way more subtle <laughs> overall, but there are still different hues there. It didn't blend completely, which I know is obvious I didn't stir it, but this was still really interesting and fun. And I'm curious to see how reproducibly I could get the effect of adding the dyes before the yarn. I'm definitely gonna play around with this more.